Episode number seven, talking about family and relationships. This is a great topic for English language learners, as it's a common area of conversation in everyday life. สวัสดีครับทุกคนยินดีต้อนรับสู่ช่อง Three Minute English with AI ครับวันนี้เราจะพูดถึงเรื่องครอบครัวและความสัมพันธ์ซึ่งเป็นเรื่องที่สําคัญและน่าสนใจมากครับ Hello everyone, welcome to Three Minute English with AI. This episode. We're diving into a topic that's close to all our hearts, talking about family and relationships. Whether you're chatting with friends or colleagues, discussing your family and relationships can be a great way to build connections. So, let's get started. Have you ever struggled to describe your family members or talk about your relationships in English? Perhaps you've wanted to share stories about your loved ones but didn't know where to begin. This week's episode is here to help. With practical phrases and vocabulary to get you talking confidently, let's see the conversation between Ryan and Jane. Hey Jane, how was your weekend? Do anything exciting with your family? It was great, thanks. We had a big family dinner on Sunday. My grandma was in town, so it was lovely catching up with her. How about you? Do you have any fun plans with your family coming up? Actually, yes. My sister is getting married next month, so we're all pretty busy with the wedding preparations. I'm going to be the best man, which is both exciting and a bit nerve-wracking. Ah, congratulations to your sister. That sounds like a lot of fun. I'm sure you'll make a fantastic best man. Are you close with your sister? Yeah, we are. We're only a year apart, so growing up, we were always getting into mischief together. Family is really important to me. That's wonderful. I'm close with my family too, especially my grandma. She's always telling me stories about our heritage, which I find really fascinating. Vocabulary and interesting phrases with examples. Close knit, meaning. Having a very strong, supportive relationship. Example: My family is really close-knit. We always support each other. Catch up, meaning to talk to someone you haven't seen or spoken to for a while to learn about their life. Example: I caught up with my old friend over coffee and heard all about her new job. Growing up, meaning the process of becoming an adult from being a child. Example: Growing up. My favorite hobby was painting. Get into mischief, meaning to behave slightly badly or playfully, often causing minor trouble. Example: As kids, my brother and I would always get into mischief during summer vacations. Heritage, meaning the traditions, language, or property that are passed down from your family or country. Example: Understanding my heritage has helped me connect with my roots. Stay tuned for next week's episode of Three Minute English with AI. Get ready for more handy phrases and vocabulary to enhance your English skills. See you then.